on this uh, article for today, <laughs> it's so very funny that uh, Salman Ekpa has been trending and uh, so many jobs is falling at him. The headline says, I am the father of all Igbos, but I don't even know who Simon Ekpa is. Chief Emmanuel Unwanyangu is the one saying that. <laughs> Simon Ekpa is in, is in mess again. Okay. It is, I am the father of all Igbos, but I don't even know who Simon Ekpa is. Chief Emmanuel Unwanyangu, uh, the President General of the Oaneze in the Igbo, a social cultural group. Uh, Chief Emmanuel Unwanyangu was granted an interview on TVC News some hours ago, where he spoke about Simon Ekpa an Igbo agitator based in Finland. Chief Emmanuel Mwanyahu said, I am the father of all Igbos, uh, but I don't even know who Simon Ekpa is. Well, uh, I will try to know him first, then travel to his place in order to appeal to him as a father. He needs to stop what he is doing. <laughs> okay, <laughs> Allah. <laughs> Speaking for that, uh, Chief Emmanuel Wanyang said, Personally, I don't believe any right thinking Igbo will stop his people from going to school or going about their occupation. Uh, well, lastly, Chief Emmanuel Wanyang said, As a father, I'll be unhappy if the governors try to use force to respond or under the situation. I know a, a good government cannot fold its hands when things are going wrong in the country, but they should not use force because we need to know why Simon Ekpa is causing a lot of damages to Igbos. Wow, uh, the thoughts of every man differs. What are your thoughts about this? What is my thought? What is our thought? Well, I don't know. <laughs> The father does not, or uh, a son that does not know the father's house, or father does not know the son's house, or uh, father does not know the father's house. I don't really know where the narrative is going, but when I was a person, you know, to his own job back to Simon Epa, but as a father also, because traditionally, I don't think Simon Epa is uh, fit to stand with the man or there about, but I believe. Um, Everybody have opinion to themselves now to the comment section that I have you know looking forward to because so many jobs like you know they will not leave the subject matter. Some persons in the comment section start you know wiggling themselves. So many funny things that could make someone laugh. Now, according to Onyeka Innocent, well, uh, he says that it will it will foolishness on my Igbo brothers and sisters to follow the directives of a man living in far Finland in order to kill your own people. Well, Igbo nation should wake up from the sleep that is uh, destroying the Igbo community. Okay, this is coming from Inyeka. Innocent. <laughs> wow. So response there. Someone says about you all obey his orders that you should stay indoors. Every Monday, who is the seven who year? Yeah, yeah. Okay, if according to what Charles said, reply would be like Charles Abayomi, it's not Simon Epa that gave order to anybody. It is. It wasn't the, uh, the, the consent of uh, Namdekanu to give order. The people that do not go for or do not go to work on Monday. They don't go for their businesses on Monday. They say sit at home. They decided it. They said until the canoe is being released before, yes, they can, you know, stop the agitation. For that Monday, sit at home. For those, some people do not know. Now, Simon Ekpa is trending because <laughs> yeah, the canoe is trending also, but in the captivity for yeah, someone that is showing that is free wants to act that is free. Yes, and it's showing his prowess and all that. But I, I believe if he really needs uh, the, lead, the leadership man to, he should come to Nigeria and um, advocate for good governance. 
then he will be handling it good that is my opinion though but i believe uh, things things are happening as it is in the government itself in the parastatas of whatever parastatas i don't want to know where parastatas i don't want to define it the they themselves that call themselves the government in general they know where the butter they pinch them according to angel brownson says those of you supporting a bar why don't you reside in your state to obey his stupid order if you relocate to another state where there is a peace and support a fool who is also in a far country to kill your innocent people making life unbearable for them or their about how many ekpa's family members are in their state now fighting and killing and being killed it's high time you people sit down and have a rethink tell ekpa to come down to his state and join hands to fight okay nessie mandela didn't stay abroad and fight for south africa so ekpa mio ekpa should come back with his family and fight okay and that was what i even said the other time even he's not going to come with his family i mean i believe i believe uh, he should come and advocate for good governance i said it before we go to this uh, comment that is the a good spirit and good bible positivity he should come definitely nobody will arrest him no, no, it's a, it's not a big deal because under the constitution we have a right to association we have a freedom of movement freedom of speech provided you are guided if it's not violent and uh, freedom of association you know self determination because yes it's a, it's a allowed protest peaceful protest shouldn't yield into condemnation or damnation or sabotage or destruction or derival yeah if everything is peaceful and moderate uh, yeah the kingdom of nigeria and the kingdom of god will nigeria put themselves into now i believe god is the only factor that can help nigeria <laughs> Ah, because it's so very, very appalling that yes, the country is just running out of laws as though you know, lending coming in and then there are other processors that are working to finance some places, but debts keep going but Thank God that Nigeria will soon be great as it is. Yes. Now there are so many people, you know, want wanting to, you know, fire back at Equa or Derba. Simon Ekpa is an offshoot of MNK. MNK, okay, Mazinam de Kanu. Again, Simon Ekpa is an offshoot of Mazinam de Kanu. Mainstream Igbo obey them because they appreciate what the duo are doing for Igbo Bia France. Umayahu is among Igbo political criminals who care about their selfish interests. Igbo are Republicans. Anyone that is in tandem with their uh, aspirations, they will support, but will not, if of course there are. Okay, well, nice point. But uh, notwithstanding, uh, this is where I'm going to draw the cutting. I would like you to share your views in the comment section, and also, you know, you know, you know what's up now. Try and you know click the bell icon to get more notification and also subscribe also share the news so that others can have an idea of what is going on we rather you know listen and we we'll say the few we can but god is the ultimate thank you for listening and god bless you